Today, I want to talk about a feature that's not really new to Microsoft Teams, but I've been using it a lot lately in my day-to-day -day work life, and that is the ability to record a, uh, a short video clip in a Microsoft Teams chat directly. This is really helpful for like whenever somebody asks you how to do something or can you show them something, and you can quickly reply with a video if you want to. So I've got this chat right here with Joe end user and Joe reached out to me and he's saying, Hey, can you show me how to share a file with OneDrive? Now, before I would have to either, you know, take screenshots or uh, type out a bulleted, you know, list in text uh, to, you know, explain how to do this, or I'd have to open up another application, record how to do it. But now I can just do it all right inside of Microsoft Teams. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click the plus button in the message box for Microsoft Teams, and I'm going to go to record video clip right here. So we're going to click on that, and it opens up this little wizard for me so I can select a camera. I'm going to select my camera right here. I can select what audio I want to use, what microphone. I'm just going to use my remote one. And then I can do a backdrop. I could like write a script. I could add other effects if I wanted to. But I'm going to record my screen. That puts me into another mode so I get like a little picture in picture. And I can change to like a square layout. I can change to a star. I can do like an AI, you know, background removal type of thing. I'm just going to leave it to a circle, but I'm going to make it, you know, a little bit smaller. I'm going to, um, you know, give it some like padding. I can move it anywhere around the frame if I want to, but I'm just going to keep it in the bottom corner. So I'm going to go click start screen recording. When I click on that, this dialog comes up where it says, hey, do you want to share, share your entire screen? So if you've got like multiple screens, you'll see your other monitors kind of showing up here. Or since I'm just doing this in OneDrive inside of a browser, I'm going to select that I want to share my OneDrive window. This is just a Microsoft Edge window. So I'm going to share just that window, and then it's going to start recording for me. So I would go through... And you can see that I'm actually recording. I can stop, I can pause, I could start recording and like kick it over again if I wanted to. But I'm going to go in and do my demo now. So, hey, y'all, this is a quick video showing you how to uh, share a one-drive file. We're going to go into the file right here. I'm going to hover over this. We're going to click onto the, uh, the share button right there. And then whenever it comes up, you're going to type in the person's name, like Joe user. You're going to select how to you're gonna do an edit and view. You're going to walk down. You can copy the link for it. You can go ahead and click send and send it to that person. I'll see you else and let me know if you have any questions. Okay, so we're done recording our video. And, whoops, we have one minute to record the video. So you saw that time counting down. These are for short, quick, little one minute or less videos. So I ran out of time. If I didn't run out of time and had time left, I would just click the stop button right there. But since I was able to knock that out in one minute exactly, now I can go through and I can edit this video. Okay, so that's the beginning of my video. I want to click on trim and I want to go forward to that point in time. There we go. So I'm just going to move that right there. And then at the end, I could also trim down the back as well if I wanted to. Now I'm down to 41 seconds. Now, if I wanted to split and rearrange things or, you know, cut something out of the middle, I could use the split button right here. I could also delete the entire clip. I could also add more to it back up to that that limit i could even add some background music so why don't we try doing that and we can play some background music here okay there's another one okay let's pick on that one we're just going to click the plus sign hey joe this is a quick video showing you how to and now I've got like even a background track under my, my video, which is pretty cool. Now we're gonna click continue right here in the uh, lower corner. And then that is going to upload that recording and share it with Joe so I can send it in a Teams message. It's processing now. We can see that, that it's processing. It's 41 seconds and I can just share that with Joe by sending it. So that's a really quick look at how you can quickly, um, you know, share a video to show somebody how to do something if it's one minute or less. Now, if it's more than a minute, 
what I would recommend is that's when you're going to want to go out to uh, to either stream or ClipChamp to do that. So you would go to office.com. You would go into uh, the more app section and then you could do it with a, a full ClipChamp project if you wanted to. Or what I would recommend is just go into Microsoft Stream, keep it nice and easy, and you could do a screen recording there. And then it would give you more time uh, to be able to explain like a, a longer concept. But if it's going to be less than a minute, you can just do it right inside of Microsoft Teams and keep it simple, keep it clean. So I hope this helps. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. And uh, thanks for watching.